Hi guys, it's me, Lakota, and today I'm gonna do a look out of my touch-up bag. This is my touch-up bag. This is what I carry with me, just like I said, touch-up. I've done my look at home already, and you know, I might wanna freshen up or whatever. There are certain things that I keep in here, and it's just for touch-up. So we're gonna see what we find in here, and we're gonna make a look out of it, cause that's not me. Let's see, the first thing I'm gonna pull out, ooh, my Avon Coco Glow Quad. I guess this is eyeshadow we're gonna be using. And you guys know I always use this blush, Avon Russet. Um, what else is in my, ooh, I do have some lip choices in here. I've got some gold, that's probably from Saturday night. I've got what I call just the matte neutral lipstick, Wet n Wild number 901. It's called Mocha Coffee, I think. Something like that. It's uh, an oldie but goodie for me. Oh, well, Mocha. Um, ooh, NYC Jane, NYC, sorry, NYC Lengthening Mascara in brown. You guys know I love my L'Oreal Double Extends, but this is the touch up, so let's see what we got in here. Um, ooh, I've got some Absolute Lip Gloss in number 13, Naughty number 13, what's this color called? Naughty. Yep, Naughty number 13. I've got my standby apple teeny, of course. I've got chapstick, and lucky me, I did have the good sense to put an eyeliner pencil in here with a sharpener. A broken sharpener, but hey, nonetheless, it's the on-the-go bag. It's the touch-up face. Well, I'm going to get started and see what I can come up with, starting off, of course, with the eyeshadow. And I don't have makeup brushes. I have only the cotton thingy that it came with. So like I said, this is supposed to be the touch-up. And the touch-up colors are neutral. I don't even have my little milk crayon that I love. Actually, it's not called Milk is Lightning by Elon, the jumbo crayon that I use. So, I'm just going to go ahead and put my base on. And I wish I would have been smart enough to already do another eye, to do one eye just to see what we get. But I'll do this one on camera for you and finish her off later, I guess. So, I don't walk around looking lopsided. I do have makeup to go do today. All right, I'm gonna make this quick here. Speed it up just a little bit for you guys. As you know, YouTube does time me out. All right, now I just took the lightest color. I'm just gonna progressively keep on going. Take the next color, the other side of the cotton thingy. Let me see here. Yep. And just do the lid. Like I said, ooh, I suck with these stupid cotton things, don't I? I might have to buy a little mini travel makeup brush set just to keep in my touch up bag. Like I said, this was just a grab bag guest look today. Okay, I'm just going to move on to the next color here. And use this to do our smoke, I guess. And I always do this kind of backwards. I know what I was thinking of when I packed this bag. I'm gonna tell on myself. Back in the day when I used to kick it with the girls and go out, you never knew if you were coming home that night. And I don't necessarily mean with a guy. I had some pretty cool girlfriends and we'd like go out to the club, do stuff afterwards, end up at one another's houses, and then somebody would always get the brilliant idea. Oh, if you've got your toothbrush in your purse, which I always did, don't go home. Let's just go to the mall nearby. Or don't go home. Let's go get my drink of choice, Starbucks. And of course, I did not want to come out looking crappy. Okay, now I'm on this last color here, which is like this dark cocoa brown or coffee brown. I'm just going to go back over what I smoked with the little frost color here. This is also a nice neutral, I say everyday interview look. 
And I can't believe that I got both eyes kind of done. And I'm going to go back in with this light color here. I'm going to go um, sideways. And just do the old do the eyebrow highlight. And I don't know what crazy arm movements I'm doing on here, but forgive me. My nails aren't done either, so that's not helping. I don't know why I'm all in sync. I know what it is. I'm trying to use this stupid sponge. Yeah. It's on and cracking, guys. It's time for me to put a makeup brush that in my touch-up bag. Okay. Now, I'm going to get me some mascara. My NYC. Ooh, this is gonna look weird. I'm used to seeing me with lots of lashes from my lower yeah. Okay. Now let's see what condition this eyeliner is. I'm real good about not sharpening it. And of course it is not sharp. Oh, gonna sharpen it. And then I'm gonna give myself some eyebrows. That's what I'm going to do. I don't have any. Feather it in. And then blend. Feather it in. And blend. This is my cheater way of doing eyebrows. And I'm going to go ahead eyeliner. Now, of course, you guys know I already put my foundation on and my powder. Oh, chapstick. Always a good lip prep. Got my blush. I am impressed by my bag. I mean, I got more in here than I thought. Plus my uh, pressed powder, you know, when I don't have foundation with me. And I love to go swimming, so touch up bag is good for that too. And some lips, let me see. Looking at my little tank top here. I think I'm gonna go with the mocha. Leave the naughty and the uh, gold alone. I'm gonna use the wet and wild 99 cent number 901 mocha. I never can just put this on. I always have to fix it up. I'll show you what I mean by I always have to fix it up. Eyeliner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're thinking. Ooh, that's so cholo. Mommy, no. I'll fix it. You'll see. The anti cholo way. I'm gonna touch up just a little bit. My shirt so peach. Wow! And this is our look from my touch up bag. This is like I said, the bag I just dropped down in my purse and carry with me because you never know. Um. Wow! I'm impressed. I packed it pretty good. Just need to add me some. Makeup brushes. Now you know what to carry in your touch-up bag. You know, your pressed powder, a neutral blush color, neutral everyday eyeshadow color, and your basics. Anyway, I'm Lakota. Ciao for now. Don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, over here. Write and comment. Ciao for now.